Your new Lexus UX300e is designed to make the most efficient possible use of power. As well as a conventional braking system, the UX300e uses regenerative braking to harvest energy that would otherwise be wasted. Regenerative braking helps to save energy by turning the kinetic energy generated when slowing down or braking into electricity which is then fed back to charge the battery. You can adjust the level of regenerative braking to suit your preference or style of driving at any time. For example, in high-speed driving you may wish to enhance the regenerative braking function. Let's take a closer look at how to set this up. You can set the regenerative braking by using the gear lever and the paddles behind the steering wheel. To select the braking mode, use the shifter to move from D to B. You can do this when you first set off or at any time while driving. But note, the shift position can only be changed to B directly from D. Once you are in B mode, you can adjust the level of regenerative braking to suit your style of driving. There are four levels ranging from mild to heavy. The mild setting means the car will slow gently when you lift your foot off the accelerator, while the heaviest will cause the car to slow much faster. To select the level, use the paddle levers. The indicator arrows in the central display will show what level you have chosen. Pull on the left minus pedal to increase the level of regeneration and the right plus pedal to make the deceleration milder. You can also temporarily change the degree of regenerative braking without having to take your hands off the steering wheel. For example, if you're descending a steep hill and want to control the speed and harness kinetic energy, you simply pull the minus pedal here, while the car's gear shifter is in D. And you can pull the plus lever to cancel it. The temporary regeneration will also be cancelled if the car is stopped, the accelerator pedal is continuously pressed, or the gear lever is shifted out of drive.